Hello and welcome to the CMD. My name is Parker Williams, aka PC Williams. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to find any or RTSP O N V I F camera, IP camera. All right, so this is real time streaming protocol. That's what it means here. I got the definition over here. Um, it's in a ne network control protocol designed for a user for use in entertainment and communication systems to control streaming media servers. All right. And what is a ONBIF? Well, OE ONBIF is open network video interface format. This is a global and open industry forum with the goal of facilitating the development and use of global open standards for the interface and some more stuff here all right so in order to find your rt sp url you need to download two programs very small programs and um you can uh download them and if you don't want to use them anymore after you finish doing this you can uninstall it. it's just that simple all right so here we'll go to you got to go to your search engine of choice and search for the o and vif device manager all right and um this is where i downloaded it from source forge and it was worked fine for me it was fast so we're gonna go here and you just click the download link and you download it and all that good stuff and set it up and you can um, you can actually pause the video right now if you like to do that and come back if you want to follow along all right so I already downloaded it so I don't need to do that and the next thing software you're gonna need is a free IP scanner all right um, this is to find the URL of the camera that's on your Wi-Fi network. Now I'm assuming you already set up your camera and everything to the Wi-Fi and all that, and you're just looking for the RTSP URL. Okay. So here you do a search for free IP scanner, and the one I downloaded is the advanced IP scanner okay it's this one it's compatible with Windows 10 this is what it looks like okay and um, you download that and then you could come back to this video like I said before I already downloaded these so now since I got these on my desktop right here it's hard to see but I got uh, these two right here the first one I'm gonna open is the advanced IP scanner all right so we're gonna open that one and right here you want to go to settings the options and I recommend just to click all these options here all right you don't have to but you know it's good to see what you got going on your your network and then you click on performance I moved it up to about the middle. You can leave it at default, it doesn't matter. All right. And now you got to go here and you click scan. And what this is going to do is going to scan your Wi Fi network to see what devices are on your, your network. This is good to find out who's on and if somebody's on there that you don't want to be on there and all that good stuff. For this case, we're gonna do it to see what the see what the URL is for our camera. All right, so we down here. You got your um, status bar, and then this is all the things that is on my Wi-Fi network. This first one here is, of course, my main router. This is my Netgear extender here this is my cell phone this is my laptop and 
this last one right here is my camera which is a generic camera and I could not find the RTSP for this I spent the better half of the day looking for the RTSP and this is when I came up with this solution so hopefully this will help you guys all right so here you click on the little arrow thing here okay and you see here it says the IP camera for the web you just double click on that and then for my camera this is what I have yours may look different it probably will look different um so this is here so I'm gonna go I'm just gonna click on this one now on yours your your interface might look different you might even find your RTSP in there but mine that didn't give me that much info on anything you know I got cheap IP cam all right so this is it here it's the IP camera I could click over here and moves this way moves that way on this one and I'm gonna go here to settings I'm gonna show you what my settings we got here here network I could not find it the RTSP URL nowhere in here for the sake of this video I'm just gonna keep moving forward all right so what you want to do is take this URL copy it okay because this is the URL the IP address for your camera this is the IP camera address all right now we're gonna go to yeah IPS cam now we're gonna go to the ONVIF device manager all right yes I'll wait for it here to load up now mine already did this so it's already set up but what you want to do is down here yours is going to be empty if it might not be it might find it automatically but if it doesn't find it automatically you gotta go here add and then you put in your the URL I gave you okay actually let's do this here cancel this all right you know, just hit add okay and then here you're gonna put the IP address that you just copied okay you paste it all right here then here put the colons and I think it's port 81 and there it is another one popped up and this here is what you should see all right the first one here is the high definition for me the second one is um, like middle definition it's not it's um let's look We'll go here let's see if this is yeah you see here this is uh 640 by 480 which doesn't look as good as this top one here which is the high definition 920 1080 all right and then this is the lowest okay so in order to find your rtsp url just go here to live video and it will be right down here and that is the url that you put into your media players or whatever you need to use it for that's the url that will work so i hope this helps you out and i hope everything's good this is my first video on this channel the cmd and i hope i did good <laughs> i appreciate you watching and one other thing, if this does not work, you might want to think about port, uh, port forwarding your you know, 554 port on your router or your extender. Usually it's the main router, right? And I will have a, a video. My next video will be on port forwarding. I'll show you how to do that.
Like I said, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. You guys have a great day.